50M and 51F Revenge Sex or Not I had been married 21 years in 2021 when I found out my wife cheated a few years prior. She told me because the other spouse found out and reached out on social media. Even worse there was multiple betrayals like porn, pics and talking with multiple ex-boyfriends. I reacted better than I thought I would and asked for details in hope of a good reconciliation. Unfortunately, she decided to lie for another two years till 2023 about details to reduce her culpability. Obviously my trust level will never return my main goal at this time has been trying to keep what's left of marriage. Now recently I met a 4 feet 10 inches 26 year old beautiful young lady. She wants to let me get it. It's almost as if either God or the devil sent her to me. She said no strings attached as well and she won't tell anyone. My question is should I have revenge sex or not? Divorce your wife and then have sex with whoever you want. Otherwise it will be a difficult divorce once she finds out. My main goal at this time has been trying to keep what's left of the marriage. Seems like seeking out revenge is going against your goals thinking face really curious why you noted the height are you 50 or 15 how can a 50 year old man be actually writing this post you shouldn't have revenge sex because it sounds like you're not treating this young woman who you say wants to have sex with you as a person in her own right You'd only be using her to get revenge against your ex. That is a disservice to her. You shouldn't because she deserves better than you. Also why do you mention that she's 4 feet 10 inches? That's very weirdly specific. Don't lower yourself to her level. Just divorce her. Then have all the sex you want. It probably won't look good in the inevitable divorce hearing. Just get a divorce because you and your wife are a match made in Hades. Your wife wouldn't trust her as far as I could throw her and you are gonna cheat on her regardless of what anyone on here says. You just posted here to brag and to see if maybe you could get some support to ease the guilt. The best you can do is divorce first so that you might not get hit as hard in the divorce. Settlement. Cheat first and she finds out. You're screwed regardless if she did it first thing as if you do divorce. Little Miss 4 feet 10 probably won't want you because there won't be any drama involved. Won't tell. Yeah if you believe that I have some ocean front property in the desert I'd be willing to part with. For you and your new woman. Not convinced this is actually revenge sex. Sounds more like he's taking his wife's cheating as the technicality for him to be able to have a guilt-free affair. Well it sure as hell ain't God who sent her. Don't use sex as a revenge. Sex is supposed to be something wonderful. Loving and not sick like what you are suggesting. What the hell does her height matter? What a strange detail to add to this story. Why are you so hyped to be with a petite significantly younger woman? The 4 feet 10 inches comment gives off creep BFFR. Why would you stay married, do you not have any self-respect? There's an old saying that those who seek revenge should dig two graves. It's accurate. The fact that you yearn to do this, which I do not blame you for, tells you your marriage is over up. Let it go. Then go have fun. It's never ever is, no strings attached. There is always a price to play. Do it after you divorce the lying cheater. When she cheated she chose to end your marriage. Lying made it worse and it sounds like she only told you since the other spouse found out. Clean out joint accounts and ruin her. Go to the reconciliation sub. R. A's 1 after infidelity and search the sub for, revenge affair. While you're at it search for, hall pass, 2. These questions come up a lot there.
The big question is, what are you hoping for here? Letting go of resentment? Restoring your self-confidence? For your own healing? I'm guessing from your hope to keep it secret you don't want to hurt her? You should assume she will find out. That tends to happen. So it is likely this would cause pain. And intention infliction of pain is never good for a marriage. It might or might not help you let go of resentment. But it would become absolutely critical that you no longer hold her cheating over her head as the hypocrisy would eat away at you. If you feel you need it for healing, that's a different story. In that case you'd be better off talking about a hall pass with your wayward spouse. Again, I would go and look at last discussions in the reconciliation sub. And talk about this with your therapist. Yes. You should have an individual counselor as you need help with your own healing. How is revenge sex going to help your situation? What's with mentioning that get it, girl's height unless he's about 4 feet 9 inches? If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Heracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like share, and subscribe.